Socializing a puppy is the most important thing that you can do when you have a puppy. Um, and one of the most important parts of that is teaching your dog to accept handling, and touching, and dressing and undressing collars and harnesses, things like that. So one of the first things we do is, with a young dog, be sure that you're making a positive association with things that some dogs would find uncomfortable. You'd be surprised how many people won't clean their dog's ears until they're eight months old, fully, uh, almost fully grown, and they have an ear infection, and that's the first time they get their ears clean. It can really turn into a dangerous situation. The dog really finds it unpleasant and might become hand shy forever. As opposed to starting with a very young dog and make, try and make a positive experience where he's having treats or cookies while you're kind of touching his ears, touching his paws, touching his tail. Also, if you get a dog like Dexter here, he's gonna require a lot of grooming, a lot of brushing, a lot of clipping. So if he doesn't get that experience until he's an adolescent, it's gonna be really difficult for him. So at this age, he's only just about 12 weeks, and and there's something called a critical stage that starts at two weeks in a puppy's life and is over at 12 weeks. So it's a pretty small window, especially if you're getting your dog at eight weeks or nine weeks, some dogs even 10 weeks. So you really have a very short period of time to get the dog to be comfortable with all these things. So starting off, we just wanna make sure that we're doing a lot of heavy handling of the fur and the feet, little mock vet visits, little mock grooming visits, things like that, with positive, positive experience. So that's how you teach your puppy how to accept handling.